Sometimes hope is difficult to find in our modern world. Poverty, crime, violence and suffering seem to be all around us. But in this world of hopelessness, we need men and women who are equipped to share the love of God with a needy world. The Cape Town Baptist Seminary is a haven of learning, equipping students to become godly servant leaders for ministry in building the church in today's society. The seminary is situated at the foot of the African continent in Cape Town, the mother city of the beautiful country of South Africa. We use a three-pronged approach to assist those who have felt called to minister. We believe you must train the head, the heart, and the hands. The first stage is training the head. The training of the head speaks to the academic realities of formal study. The Cape Town Baptist Seminary has been accredited by the Department of Education and the Council on Higher Education, which helps us to maintain the quality um, of theological education, as well as to guarantee our students that what they are receiving is an acceptable educational qualification. The courses are tough. They're, they're not just uh, Mickey Mouse. They're, they're meant to be academically strong, and they are. They have an open door policy which is also very encouraging to us so if ever we feel like okay this is going too far for me we have the opportunity to actually go to them speak to them about it. The library facilities are fantastic with the number of just resources and selections. Books, audios, DVDs, uh, journals, internet access, kind of all that sort of stuff so it makes research, it makes looking for resources really easy for me. The lectures, their dedication to the work that they're doing, really you can see that they are pastors who are preparing pastors for the pastoral ministry. Of course, pure academic training is not enough to prepare students for such a unique spiritual calling. And so we spend time also focusing on the heart. The training of the heart speaks to the formation of the person. We seek to nurture um, the spiritual development of students both personally and corporately at the seminary. Everything we do is, has a direction into how does this impact on us spiritually and how does this impact the people we work with spiritually. People have actually come up to me and said, um, you know, you're at the seminary, shame. You know, you, you're losing the fire inside, you're losing your passion because you're spending all your time in books. But for me, it's really been the opposite way. Uh, spending time in the books, learning more about God, has really grown me spiritually. We have chapel every uh, day of the week, and uh, there we sing together, we praise the Lord together. Um, somebody preaches, um, which, which gives you really a bond with students uh, as a group together. But I really feel um, we are like a spiritual family here. Being a Christian institution, there's a lot of prayer. We start lectures off. Um, and it just helps focus, it helps remind us that we're not just studying some subject, we're studying a spiritual subject, we're focusing on God, and so we need His strength and His assistance in that. Finally, we want our students to get their hands dirty. Our outreach programs and mission work in local communities give the students a taste of what to expect in life beyond the seminary. The training of the hands speaks to the integration of academic knowledge as well as the spiritual development of the person that when they step into a particular environment they do have the practical skills to be able to lead their congregation or to lead the organization in a way which integrates um, what we believe it means to be a, a Christian. You have practical stuff that you need to do, um, part of your assignments. So they'll give you a topic, for example, counselling children, and then you have to go out and find a child with, that's been in a crisis and actually minister to them, spend time with them. A mission week, for instance, you really get to go into the community um, and actually reach out to the people. We go into some of the schools, we go, uh, some go into the prison, um, others go into Care Haven, a house of battered women uh, just next door. Um, so really, uh, you can reach out with the gospel to people. All these things that people are doing, we never look at them like ministry. You know, orphanages, looking after people with AIDS, 
you know, all those things. So for me, that was a challenge and I said to myself, wow, there's so much that can be done in this world. The internship program uh, runs over 14 weeks and it is strategically placed uh, within the curriculum of Cape Town Baptist Seminary uh, to allow the student to make the transition from uh, his academia into a pastoral setting and to give him the experience and the exposure of what might be expected and what is expected in the context of a pastoral uh, setting. The three aspects of head, heart and hands come together when our students finally graduate and enter the world, fully prepared and inspired to share the gospel with a world in need. I'd have no hesitation recommending the seminary to somebody because of things like resources, because of lecturers, all of those sort of things that you can get and do and experience at the seminary. To me, it is truly a well-rounded education, a well-rounded equipping for ministry. Zeal without knowledge is dangerous. That's why uh, Paul wrote to Timothy and he said, study to show yourself approved, rightly dividing the word of truth. Any person that is considering to come to the Cape Town Baptist Seminary, go for it. God desires people with knowledge. The challenges within our society are enormous. They are ethical challenges, they are political challenges, they are deep spiritual challenges. The influx of people from the rural areas into the city has resulted in massive growth. Um, a growth in which churches are being challenged on all levels. We, we see our role as trying to nurture that process so that we can all live together um, as, as God's people, um, seeking to meet the different needs and the challenges within society. The Cape Town Baptist Seminary is ready to make a difference. We are ready to fulfill the Great Commission as recorded in Matthew 28, 19, to go and make disciples of all nations. If you feel God's calling and would like to make a difference, the Cape Town Baptist Seminary will equip you as a pastor, youth or children's pastor, missionary or for workplace ministry. For undergraduate studies, they have to keep in mind that we have two programs. Um, the BTH program, which is a full-time program, and then also the BMIN program, which is the part-time program um, for which you can study at night time for those students who work. As a registered higher education training institution, our courses therefore range from a bachelor's degree right up to a doctoral degree. Our postgraduate degrees we offer in cooperation with the University of Victoria. But we believe that, that all of those degrees aren't just academically structured. All of them have a practical component in, in, in being able to help our students to not just understand the Bible, understand theology, but to be able to apply the Bible and theology to a changing environment, an environment in which one has to be academically qualified, but also practic practically suited um, to, to, towards those ministries. We come to Cape Town Baptist Seminary to be blessed and to be a blessing to us. The Cape Town Baptist Seminary, training the head, the heart, and the hands to make a difference in the modern world. For more information or to partner with us, you may contact us at telephone number 2721 637 9020 or visit our website at www.ctbs.org.za or you can send us an email info at ctbs.org.za Our postal address is P.O. Box 38473 Gatesville 7766 Cape Town, South Africa